In today's vlog, we are going to cook chop suey, vegetable chop suey. And I have with fish, and I have here uh, fish. This is hockey fish, uh, fillet fish. So I just sprinkle sweet paprika and ground pepper. And now I have to sprinkle a garlic pepper and and I have to squeeze um, lemon this lemon so lemon and I have to add a tablespoon of corn flour and flour so I forgot the salt, so I have to sprinkle salt as well. And sprinkle salt. So with your clean hands, you have to coat the fish so it will be distributed to the fish. And then we have to set aside this first before frying. So I have here uh, bok choy leaves, parsley, carrots, capsicum, and then this one, the steam of the steam of bok choy, beans. And what else? Yeah, I have her also a cauliflower, cauliflower. So this is my so this is my chop soy version. And here I have also um, onion, tomato ginger garlic what else in here i think that's it and now we have to start cooking so in a pan so we have to put this is olive oil extra virgin oil so that's extra virgin oil and then we have to wait then it's going to a bit hot before we're going to put the onion garlic when the oil is a bit hot you have to add this onion garlic ginger and tomato this is all good for you going to boost your immune system all this stuff especially the onion the ginger the garlic tomato so we have to wait till the ginger the onion gets brown before we add the other vegetables hmm smells so good very aromatic so now we can add these vegetables so we have to start with the carrots um, everything the carrots the capsicum the beans we have to add it together and the steam of Steam of bok choy. So the last one are the the bok choy leaves. Mix it all together, so all the flavor will be distributed to the vegetables. I 
and then you have to add the cauliflower and mix it all together so you can add a bit of sauce sprinkle sauce and ground black pepper the ground black pepper and we have to add the ground chop paprika or sweet paprika and yeah, just garlic and mm. garlic powder of the chip and then we have to mix it all together to distribute all that flavor to the vegetable cover the vegetables to infuse all the flavor to the vegetables for at least two minutes so in a bowl we have to add soy sauce, maybe one tablespoon, yeah, one tablespoon, and boiling water as well. Maybe half a cup, and mix it all together because this is our sauce. We have to check our vegetables. Yes, yeah, mostly good. So, you can add, because I have here in my kitchen vegetables, flavor or stock powder, you can add a sprinkle, maybe a teaspoon. Like that, not just a teaspoon. You can also sprinkle some chili left if you have just a little bit. Okay. And mix it together. And now you can add the soy sauce. Next sure, this is the mixture of boiling water and soy sauce. So, the vegetable we're going to fully cook. So, I have to finish it all. Cover it again and let the vegetables cook. Add the corn flour. It is one tablespoon of corn flour, and then you can add some hot water. In it. This is we have to add this one later to our vegetables we have to set aside this one first so we have to check our vegetable if it's already the vegetables are already cook and we have to taste it also if it is according to my taste mm, perfect have that spiciness it's not that salty just perfect and now we can add the bok choy leaves or we call this one in the philippines as pichai the bok choy and the parsley so the bok choy leaves is already there are already there 
so we just let it uh, cook but not to too cook not too much so we can now add our mixture the cornstarch mixture so this is the cornstarch uh, corn mixture just to thicken the sauce and then cover and let it simmer for maybe two minutes just put it in a very low okay. so after one minute just this one yeah it's really done guy it's really cook mm. very nice very nice and the cauliflower and then we have to set aside this one and we're going to cook the fish start frying the fish what we had uh, marinated just before so when the oil is starting to get hot we, have, we can now fry the, uh, the fish so we have to test first if the oil is hot already this is not olive oil it's just a normal oil when you fry the fish so when it's you put the the ladle and started to bubbles. That's the time you can tell that it's hot. Starting to bubble. And now we start to fry. Oh, so we're frying the fish now. Struggle is real. <laughs> guys so don't judge me i'm not good in frying fish so this is the fish it's done food is ready guys so this is the chop suey looks very delicious and it's really delicious and that's the fish fried fish so and this is our the leftover from yesterday beans and you can eat it with rice thank you for watching guys see you on my next vlog please subscribe